Hello YouTube and welcome to lesson 15 of the Adobe InDesign tutorial series and today we're going to see how to thread text frames inside of InDesign. So over here, uh, if you were to go over here to the file, you can go to place and you can import my text image right here. So I'm going to go into my desktop and I got my TXT file right here and I can just open this out. If we were to click it, you can see that all the text files actually come up just like that. I can also alternatively go to file, go to place over here and select the text file just like this and click and drag to create a text frame. But once I do that, you notice that this actually displays just a portion of the text and others are actually remaining. So what you can do is you can see the red icon right here. It um, means that more text is actually remaining just like that. So what you can do is you can simply click on this and then you can click on and drag a text icon right here and you can see that it actually continues this right here. So if I were to, let's say, type in something, you can see that the text actually continues on to this section right here. So what is actually happening is that this uh, text frame is being linked to this. And so uh, after the text uh, uh, gets entered here, it'll actually continue on from this section right here. You can also alternatively create icons such as these and then go on to the selection tool, click this, uh, let's say click this and then click over here and you can see that the continuation actually now continues from here. So this is the text frame right here, the main text frame, uh, it continues all the way onto this section, then it comes to this section right here and you can click it and drag it for continuation of the text just like that. And you can see that this is how you can uh, thread text frames and this is known as threading text frames just like that. Usually if you want to create columns of text and so forth, then this is actually quite helpful. So let me just go to place and then select the InDesign text right here. So let's say for example, I got my major text over here. Uh, sorry, I'm gonna import another one. So I'm going to go to place right here, new text document, there you go. So click and drag, you can see that I have my main text here. You click this and then I got my first column over here and then click this again, then I got my second column right here. So what is happening is that the text frame is aligning uh, this space right here. So this is my main text, which is continuing on to this section right here. So this is being continued on to this section and this is being continued on to this section. So I can resize this and you can see that the text actually readjusts just like that. And this really helps you with the design, um, designing part on however you want to place your text. So this is how you can thread text frames inside of InDesign. Hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.